Hey y'all, so this is the first outfit right here. Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all. Welcome back. Welcome back to Tanae TV. Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Monday, April 3rd. Um, I'm on lunch right now. I just grabbed some Chick fil A. I got a salad with some grilled chicken. Um, I'm gonna show y'all when I get home. Head home right now. Um, yeah, I got a salad because I forgot to take the chicken out yesterday. Uh, I was gonna meal prep some chicken, chicken breast, and some broccoli, and maybe some rice. I don't know. So I was gonna meal prep, but I forgot to take it out. So it's still in the freezer. I need to take it out today so that I can meal prep tomorrow. So today can be my last day eating out. Hopefully, I don't know. But yeah, um, I want to start eating more healthy. So that's why I got a salad with grilled chicken this time instead of the fried chicken that they give the nuggets or whatever they sell it. Oh, they so good. It's so good. It's my first time actually trying their grilled chicken. So I hope it's good. We'll see. But um, at 2 o'clock, I got to go back to the apartment. They doing the final walkthrough, and I'm gonna get them the keys back, and I'm done with that. I'm done with it. So yeah, um, I'm gonna talk to y'all. Oh my god, this van cannot go. This will keep coming, but I'm gonna talk to y'all um later, or I'm I'm gonna talk to y'all when I get home, show you the salad, and I'm gonna just talk to y'all throughout the day. I might make this a weekly vlog. I might or a two day vlog because I want to start posting more. So I might do two days, two days, stuff like that. But yeah. So this is what it's looking like. Grilled chicken. Got some strawberries, some apples, some um, blueberries. And I got some roasted almonds to go with it. And then two garden herb ranch dressing. So yeah. Oh, and it came with some granola. But I'm probably not going to put this granola on there. Just turn the keys in, y'all. Uh, they gotta um, repaint some stuff, and that's pretty much it. So I should begin a lot of the deposit back, because I already know painting and stuff ain't gonna take that much. So um, I'm headed back to work now. I don't wanna go, honestly. I took a nap on lunch, and it's like, once you take that nap, <laughs> It's over with. You don't want to do nothing. I knew I shouldn't have took that now, but the bed was right there, so I just took it. So I'm headed back to work. Um, yeah. I got to do hair Thursday as of now. We got a four day. My son still got to go to school Friday. What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? So y'all already know what I'm doing. Y'all already know what I'm on. I'm making a hookah. I'm making a hookah. I want to come tell y'all though, I had set up an appointment. I set up an appointment to get a silk press. Originally, I wanted um, some individual, not individual, some invisible locks. That's what I really wanted, but I can't really find nobody for real that ain't charging an arm and a leg. I looked on some people's website. For the invisible locks, the short ones, y'all, the short ones, they charging one eighty and above for short, short, big parts, one eighty and above for invisible locks. Invisible locks is not even locks. It's not. It's not instant locks. It's not permanent locks. It's literally twisting your hair, then two strand twisting it down. Wrapping it up and around. That ain't, that's not, that's not 180 and above to me. I don't even charge that much for the short ones. But, shit, I don't know. But yeah, when I seen those prices, I was like, ain't no way. For a style that might not even last that long? No. So, um, I was looking on the websites and I seen this other girl lady woman 
she do silk presses. I looked at her pictures, but she look nice. One difference is she's like 40, 40 minutes away. She in Richmond Hill. So Friday, when my son go to school, I'm gonna go to Richmond Hill and I'm gonna get a silk press and a trim. I already know when I get my trim, it's gonna be a lot because I haven't had a trim in a long some years I haven't had a trim because I've just been doing wigs and braids and stuff like that. I ain't had no trim in a little minute, so I already know. And like when I when I'm doing my hair, I can feel the split in, so I know she's gonna have a lot to cut. But yeah, my first time getting a silk press. Um, this is my first time getting a silk press since I've been natural. Since I've been natural, that is a long time. So, I'm going to bring y'all with me. I'm going to try to um, record a little bit on my camera, if she don't mind. Y'all. I came to say good morning. I'm on lunch. Um, for my lunch, I came to the nail salon real quick. Because I had some little peach fudge and I want to get away. So, I got um, a chin lip and my eyebrows waxed. She didn't do my eyebrows how um, the brow tint lady did them, but they still look good for real. Just a little thing right here. They look good. She was wiping my chin and stuff off with that cotton pad and didn't even get all this stuff out. So she let me walk out like that. So that's unprofessional, but she did good. When she was taking that wax off, I don't know if it's cause I don't get waxed often. But when she was um, ripping the wax off, it, sound, it felt like she was literally ripping, like snatching hard as crap. Yeah, I'm finna go home and wash my face off. I need to get rid of those cotton pads and get something else or something. But I like it. Yeah. She put too much. But yeah, y'all. Um, I just came here. Cause y'all, when you look good, you feel better. I woke up this morning and I was a little, uh, like I was wasn't feeling it. Didn't want to go to work. I just wanted to lay down for real. But yeah, so I, I wasn't feeling it this morning. So I decided to um, get my eyebrows done. Because I was going to make an appointment for the brow tint, the brow tint lady. So she could wax them. I cannot freaking talk. I can never talk. What in the world? I was going to make an appointment with my. Um, brow lady so she could wax and tint my brows again but I was gonna make it for Friday like I, I think I told y'all if I'm gonna do a um a maintenance vlog but she was booked like she was booked this week and then um this weekend she wasn't like she didn't have no appointments available so I guess she wasn't working maybe she doing something for Easter weekend something I don't know But um, this morning, I, I don't know, I just woke up feeling down, I guess, because I don't understand people, how can I put this? I don't understand people who um not there for their kid, right? So first of all, you're not there for your kid on the regular. Then since you ain't there, you get put on child support. And now that you're on child support, you really ain't gonna be there. And you don't wanna do shit until you get off child support, which is weird. Cause it's like, if you don't take me off child support, then I'm not gonna be no father or no parent. But I mean, you just don't wanna be one at all anyway. 
and you're using child support as an excuse. Like, who says my kid got a phone so whenever they want to talk, they can talk. But phones work both ways. If you want to talk, you can call. If you don't call, then that's okay too. Do you not want to talk to your kid? I'm confused. Like, the phone work both ways. So if your kid never called, then y'all never gonna talk. So I guess you ain't gonna um, call either then, I guess, huh? Let them know if you enjoy um boxing. Yes. You did? That's good. We in Walmart right now, y'all. I'm cooking so baked beans, fish, and macaroni and cheese. All right, y'all, so we done eating. I'm about to watch a little YouTube. He finna take a shower. He gotta um, go to bed. He helped me cook. His bedtime is at 9, it's 8.30, so he finna take a bath. And then go chill until it's time for him to lay down. And then when he go to sleep, I'm gonna make a hookah. So today, I'm supposed to be eating healthy, right? But today was kind of like a cheat day because we cooked the baked beans, the fish, and the macaroni and cheese. I don't know why. I just wanted some baked beans. And it always go good with macaroni and cheese. And I was like, what meat do I want? I don't know. So I chose. I wanted some fried catfish. But Walmart didn't have, it had catfish, but it was frozen, the catfish filet. I really don't even like the catfish filet. I like the catfish straight out the pan with the bones and everything in it. Just cut the head off, boom. That's what I really like. With the tail still on there too. But they didn't have that. It was only frozen catfish fillets and I want to hurry up and get home and cook it. So I just got tilapia. And it was pretty good too, but it's the catfish just better. Catfish is better, so yeah. Um my day started off a little uh but as it went on it got better he really liked the um boxing so i'm glad about that i can't wait to um i'm gonna put him i'm gonna sign him up officially today you get a first um first class is like a free trial so you don't have to pay nothing but i'm gonna sign him up when he get back from spring break so not next week, but the week after that, he gonna start. And, yeah. That's pretty much it. Hey, y'all. Happy Wednesday. Um, I'm leaving work right now, but I'm not going home. I gotta go back to work. I'm just leaving to um, go to Starbucks on base. 
I'm gonna get a um, strawberry refresher with water or lemonade. I don't know which one I want. I usually get it with water, but the lemonade might be good too. So I'm gonna get that, and then I'm gonna just go back to work. It is 87 degrees. That's what the car say. I know it's above 85. I don't know what the weather app say, but it's 87 degrees. It is hot as crap. It's hot. So you know what I did? I went on Walmart and I ordered a um, kid 3-in-1 slide pool and sprinkler. It's like a little cheap when it's something like thirty something dollars. And I ordered a water hose because I don't got a water hose. And um, when I get off, we're gonna be outside today. I'm let uh, pump it up, and then hook the water up, let him play, and all that. Cause it's hot, like it's it's some good weather, but ooh, that heat. So yeah, um, we're gonna do that. We're probably gonna eat some leftovers. I got some leftover um, baked beans, a whole other pan of baked beans some more fish i might make some um rice to go with it or i might make some rice to go with it or i might make some um potatoes i don't know i don't know but we're gonna eat them leftovers um have a little pool day and yeah that's it we gotta make his so tomorrow they doing um egg drop challenge egg drop experiment we gotta make him something tonight so that when he drop his egg, his egg won't break. I don't know what we're gonna do, but probably like put a parachute on it or something. I don't know, but that's gonna be fun. I'm gonna show y'all that. I turned the air off real quick so y'all can hear me better, but it's too hot, so I'm gonna just have to talk to y'all in a few minutes. serving breakfast till 10 30 so i'm gonna sit in the parking lot till 10 30 and get in a drive through so that i can get us some lunch real quick because that's what he wanted mcdonald's so i'm gonna get some mcdonald's take it back to him so i can eat lunch with him I told y'all already I have a four day weekend so I'm off today and Monday I took my son to school already so now I'm about to go get some breakfast and then head to Richmond Hill for my hair appointment at nine so yeah can I get a camera macchiato hot please yeah what size um grande is grande uh, the large uh grande is the medium Venti? Yes, please, Venti. All right. Yeah, and then a, baker, a bacon gouda and egg sandwich. All right. There and that's, that's it. Thank you. All right, y'all. This is what it's looking like. Um, I like it. I like it. I'm about to get some gas right now, though. I did not film. I didn't record. In there, because I was a little nervous. Okay. I ain't recording that because I was a little nervous. I 
hands feel way better. I feel like she could have cut maybe a little bit more. But she was um she was doing all the little turns. You know how they want you to pull the hair out, put it this way, put it that way, up, all that. So maybe she got them all. She said it wasn't as bad. I thought I was gonna come out like this with a bob. But I guess those protective styles have been working. Then she just curled the front a little bit. Um, this is my first silk press in a long, well, my first silk press. This is my first time, like, um, having it straightened in a long time. And then, I think it's my first time since I've been natural, straightening out and actually wearing it. Um, I straightened out once before to, like, a top knot bun or a, a low bun, but I didn't wear it out like this. And this is my first trim in a little minute, so, yeah. Nervous. Anyway, um, she did a little bang. The bang a little fluffy, but um, like this right here. Feel a little weird. But yeah, she did use a lot of product. I don't know if it's because I haven't had it straight in a long time. Just not bouncy or what but yeah y'all um i might wear it for this weekend then i'm gonna wear it to work next week and like a little ponytail but that's about it yeah <sighs> i don't know what it is if it's because my hair ain't been straight in a long time or what. Uh, I looked at the back. The back looks good as far as, like, the trim cut or whatever is even. It feels good. It's a little rough, like, right here on the um, middle pieces of my hair. Because some of it, like, somewhere back here, I was taking my full locks out and I cut a piece of my hair. Other than that, y'all, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it, honestly, because it's puffy. Like, it's hot outside, yeah, but it's only 11 something. It's not supposed to, it's not even that hot right now. It's going to get hotter throughout the day, but it's puffy. And I paid 120 for a silk press and a trim. And a silk press, it got to be my hair because she was taking her time, small pieces. It gotta be my hair. And I just tried to go in there and wrap it. And y'all, I forgot how to wrap. I know it's like this, comb it around. But when I got over here, this hair, this hair kept falling out. I was like, you know what? Forget it, forget it. I'm probably gonna um wear like a little bang part right here like this or something. Damn, I'ma just claw clip the back. I'm going to wear it like that for a weekend. I might, um, I've been thinking about doing some knotless, some large knotless bohemian braids. I really want some freedom braids, but I can't find anybody to do them, so. I might, might do my hair Sunday. Cause I got to do hair Monday, so I might do it Sunday. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. But this... This only going to be on a ponytail. Mm -mm. But I am glad that I um, went and got a trim. Because it was much needed. It was much needed. So, yeah, this ponytail claw clip. That's about it. Mm. I'm glad I ain't do no middle part because that would look even more janky. So yeah, I'm waiting on my food to get here. Um, I'm gonna eat and watch the new three episodes of Love Is Blind. They got two more. They gotta come out. I wish they would just drop everything at one time. Cause I get tired of waiting until Fridays. I feel like I'm resting my week by trying to watch a dang show. So I wish they would just drop everything. They'll get a lot of views that way, but. I understand it. So, 
yeah, I'm about to watch that. Wait on my food to come. And, um, yeah. What's up, y'all? I haven't talked to y'all since before Easter weekend. I don't know, but today is Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. We had a four-day. Well, we had Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday off. Matter of fact, I did talk to y'all Friday when I got my hair done. I think that was the last time. So, Saturday, um, my son was been getting his hair cut, but the barber texted and said his kids were sick. So, yeah. Didn't do nothing. Um, we chilled the whole day. Sunday, which was Easter, I was gonna cook. I was gonna cook a big breakfast, but um, he just wanted cereal. And then I was watching my friend's daughter. She just wanted waffles, so they had cereal and waffles for breakfast. I cooked um, something slight that night. I cooked some chicken, macaroni and cheese mashed potatoes and then some um Brussels sprouts then monday i took her to daycare and then i did hair i don't know if i showed y'all but i'll insert a clip the other day i took my son to meet my mom for spring break so he's with her for spring break and yeah that's it um i'm just here right now about to write down on my plans for the rest of the month but they talking about something we gotta be at formation at six o'clock i don't know so whenever we get off i'm gonna do that i'm doing hair tomorrow um the point was at 5 30 but now they talking about um we're gonna have formations every day at 6 p.m so i asked her if she can come at 6 45 she said that was cool thursday not doing nothing I want to figure out if I can find somebody to do my hair Thursday or Friday. If not, then I'm just going to do it. I don't know if I'm going to do jumbo, knotless, bohemian braids, or if I want to do um, some, like, right here, butterfly locks. I don't know. I think the butterfly locks will last longer, but the um, jumbo knotless will be quicker. So, I don't know, but I'm going to do one of them. Because everybody just charge too much. So, I might just do one of those. I might do it with my hair still straightened. I don't know if that's going to affect it. Because it's my first time having my hair straightened in a long time. So, would it affect it if I get it? And then, my hair is straight under it? I don't know. But... Yeah, then Sunday, um, I'll do some more medium knotless braids. And that's it. School, the last school day is coming up. Field day is coming up. Other than that, that's it. I need to go ahead um, and start filling out the rest of the months. Like May. I'll do it three months at a time, so I need to fill out May, June, July. Cause this is how it comes. I remember I showed y'all before. It's just blank and I put everything in. So I might just sit here and do that um, until we need something to do at work. If not, I'm just gonna be sitting here until six o'clock. But I'm gonna come back and talk to y'all in a few minutes. All right, y'all, so I just um, grabbed the hair. I'm about to go grab me something quick to eat and then get started on my hair. Yeah, I'm gonna let y'all see a little bit of that, but 
I'm gonna try to record a video of it. So y'all won't see all of it. So yeah, talk to y'all later. I just finished um cutting my hair up. I did them kind of big. So yeah. I'm finna get started twisting and I'm gonna come back and talk to y'all when I finish. <laughs> What's up, y'all? So I just got back from getting my toes done. I got them white, of course. Um, I didn't show y'all that, but I will. I'm about to eat some food right now. I got some lemon pepper wings. <laughs> um, dry this time. I, didn't, I usually get lemon pepper in my mix, but I just got dry. Some fries. About to eat, and then uh, go to my friend's house. Play some game. Why is shit so loud? But yeah, I didn't show y'all got my belly pierced today to top and bottom. Um, I had it before, but what? do y'all hear that? It's so loud, like it's in here, but it's not. I had top and bottom done before. Um, I had to do height and weight, took them out, and they closed up. <laughs> but the top was, ooh, the top was in for like a year already, so I thought it had closed, but it was just too hard to push back in. So when she did it today, she just pushed it right on in there. Of course it was like, ooh, but she pushed it right on in there. Didn't even need to use a needle or nothing. But she needed to use a needle for the bottom because I didn't have the bottom that long anyway. But the top, I knew for sure it should have been healed. So, yeah, got that done. Feet done. I'm good. Now, next thing I need to do is lose his belly. And I'll be good too. I always get white, y'all. What's up, y'all? So, I just got off work. I'm about to head to the hair store right now. I got to do hair um, tomorrow and Sunday, but I like to get the date. I like to get the hair the day before. So, I can, like, prep it and everything and make sure I got enough. Um, so, yeah, that is where I'm about to go. Then I'm going to get me a smoothie. And I'm going out to eat later. Um, little birthday dinner. We're gonna go to Olive Garden. I might dress up. I don't know yet. I might do a little something, something. Like a little casual dress up or something. I don't know. So I'm gonna bring y'all with me for that too. Um, I'm doing butterfly locks over, over locks tomorrow. So I'm gonna make sure my camera charged up for that. Cause I've been telling y'all I'm gonna record doing hair for the longest. But my angles don't be good for real. Like I have the camera sitting on the ring light. And once I'm in the zone doing hair, I don't be feeling like moving the ring light different sides and stuff like that. But I need to get better with that because I wanna show y'all um, how I do hair. So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to y'all when I get to the hair store. All right, y'all, so I'm home. Um, I had to go to two different hair stores because one of them didn't have the stuff that I needed. So, one of them didn't have the stuff that I needed, so yeah. So, let me get y'all situated. I want y'all to see my room. Okay, boom, so I had to go to two different hair stores. Um, I just bought all the hair I needed for the weekend. I'm doing some butterfly locks, over locks, like I told y'all. And then I'm doing some um, knotless, medium knotless braids. Whew. Some medium knotless braids that's going to be 27350 and orange mix. So I'm going to mix that up Saturday because she's coming Sunday morning. I'm going to mix all that up. And, yeah. 
Y'all, I don't know how long these locks will stay in because I forgot how tight they are. Like, I don't feel like waiting on it to loosen up. So, yeah, I'm going to just... Maybe next weekend I'm going to take them out. But I wanted to show y'all before I take my shower because we're going to leave like 5.45 and it's 4.32 right now. So... I'm about to take my shower and then start getting ready. I don't know what I'm going to wear yet. Uh, I have like, I got three outfits I might try on for y'all. Um, yeah. So I want to come show y'all my lashes real quick because I'm rambling. So these are the lashes. lashes. These are the lash um, styles that I like. It's like a whiskey. That's one. Um, I don't know which one I'm going to wear tonight. They kind of all the same. I might wear one. I might wear this one. Alright y'all, so um, the outfits that I got are from Shein. I just ordered a big Shein package. Um, most of the stuff, I'm not even going to lie, most of the stuff is for my son. And then I just got me like a couple of dresses because y'all know sundress season is coming up. So I just got um, a couple of dresses for me. And then most of that stuff is just for him. And I ordered so much that they gave me the option to get something free. So I just chose this thing um, to go in the bathroom and in the bath, in the shower, I guess. Hang out stuff. But you know what I'm talking about. I know y'all don't see me with Sunday. Um, yeah. I got this is not even a she and haul. I'm gonna do a separate one um just for my stuff. But I want to show y'all how much stuff I ordered. So I got some earrings too. I don't know what it is about earrings but or jewelry in general, but I'm a sucker for gold. These bracelets. I love gold, even though gold doesn't match. Everything I feel like it does. I don't know. But yeah. And this is the package. This is the package. So y'all can get an idea of how much stuff I really ordered. Okay. So um, let me see this outfit. And it really all comes down to if I got shoes to match it or not. I don't know if I want to wear no heels. So, I just want him like a bunch of shorts and t-shirts for the summer. It's too bright probably. This might be too bright. Yeah. This dress. The dress y'all seen me wear yesterday to get my nails done. Feet done. That was um, that was Shein too. See, all this stuff say um, Shein kids, so I can't even find what I'm looking for. All right, well, I got it, and as I'm trying it on, as I'm trying it on, I'm gonna um, insert a little picture from the website of what it looks like. I'm gonna try it on in my hair room. So I'm gonna put this in here. Then I'm gonna go take a shower, come back, and show y'all what I'm talking about.
All right, y'all, so this is the first outfit right here. It's just a jumpsuit. Um, I know y'all can't see the whole thing because I don't know how folks be doing that anyway, but this is what it looks like. Let me turn it This is what it looks like. Oh, there you go. So, this. And then it just comes out with wide leg bottoms. And then I just have on some heels. And then this is the back. I could see that. But yeah, this is the back. So yeah, that's outfit number one. Um, this is more like. This is more like a brunch or something with the girls. I don't think I'm gonna wear this one. Yeah. Dang, this is it. Okay. So you can do it um this way like this. Two. So. Is it even focusing on me, y'all? This number one, I might just take this one out all together. I like it though, it's really cute. But I might wear it, um, I might wear this to, like I said, like a brunch or something. I'm gonna lose a little weight, it's not gonna be stuck there. All right, y'all, this is number two. Um, I just pulled it all the way up here like this to try to cover my rows up. This is the back. I really like two pieces like this, but like I said, I don't like my weight, so I'm gonna have to wait until I um lose this to actually be like, ooh. But yeah, um, I don't know how I feel about this one because I don't really have no shoes to wear with it. These heels gonna have to go with something. And I mean, they go with it, but this one like a flats type outfit. Ooh, can you stand up? Mm. Let me see. How y'all feel about these heels? Okay, y'all, so this is the outfit I'm going to wear. I'm going to wear it with the black heels. The black is throwing me off just a little bit. Um, so, let's see. So, it ties in the front like this. It ties in the front like this, but I just wrapped it around the back because I don't want to, um, I don't want to tie it like this. Yeah, I don't want these to be in the front, so um, I put it in the back. I'm about to throw this. I'm about to throw this in the um, dryer real quick on D wrinkle, and do our edges, and I'm gonna come back and talk to y'all, and lotion my legs too. Okay.
that nigga for sure. You are mom.